teenager feels very intimidating, I think, because you're not a little kid anymore. And so it's not, oh, how cute, but you're not an adult, so you um, don't have as much independence. And so it's just that stage where you kind of feel like you have to prove who you are, like make yourself, give yourself a spot. There's a lot of peer pressure in being a teenager today, depending on what group you hang out in. You can be pressured to make bad choices, or pressured to keep up good grades, or pressured to practice more, to be a better player of your instrument, or to sing better, or pressured to do this solo or that. Like, just a lot of pressure. You know, when you're a teenager, you have a lot of friend changes, you know, you have a lot of school changes, emotional, physical changes. It's a lot of just like growing up to do when you're a teen and it's hard with all of like the pressure. It may be from church, it may be from school, from home. It is hard. Yeah. Because you know you have school and then school is hard. Stressful. Great. Yeah, you have your grades to worry about. You have to worry about your future, about what college you're going to, then you have your debt, and then you know like you're gonna get a job, a house, a car and all that good stuff, and you just don't know what will happen. Yeah, it's scary. You also have the teachers pressuring you to decide on what you want to do for the rest of your life. And you're like, I have no idea. You know, I feel it's about time to choose. I think I summed it up. What is it like to be a young adult? Honestly, a little frightening. <laughs> um, I'm currently a 25 year old woman who graduated college a few years ago. I'm still trying to find my place, still trying to get a grasp of finances and um, what I'm supposed to do career-wise or how I'm supposed to get to that point career-wise. So it's a little frightening. For me, at this stage in life, it's really awkward. People my age are kind of all over the place, whether it's still in school or finishing school or getting married or settling down or running around and not settling down. You're trying to figure out where your place is, and where you belong, and what you want to do, and sometimes that is a slower process for people like me. To be an adult at this point in my life in this church is busy and a little chaotic, but good. Um, there are lots of things to do, um, being on committees, being in charge of Cumberland kids, and also personal life. Like there's there's just a lot to do. It it always feels um, it just it always feels a little busy. I think it's hard to find the balance with life and and being involved in the church and keeping up with your personal life and having healthy relationships, um, you know, with friends, coworkers and everything. Going right out of youth group into church, there like right then there were people my age where I was going and so it was easy to hang out with you know because we all just graduated and so we are all still together um, however like going to a new church um, like it's a little difficult just because you know there's youth group there's maybe more adult groups but there's not really young adult groups and I feel like we're young adults have our, our own little spot in life where we're still, we're not youth and we're not adult adults. So we still need that, you know, encouragement and stuff like that. Within our church is changing just because we have a young adult group now. We didn't have that and it was kind of like if you were not an adult and not a youth, you were just kind of in limbo in the church. So now at least there's a little more footing for trying to figure out where you belong. I'm always encouraged to continue to stay involved in church and not let, like, um, not let having a kid and being a young mom pull me back from anything, which is kind of cool because I feel like a lot of other places probably wouldn't do that. One thing the church can do for young adults is just being there, but also being like, kind of a support system and those the older members of the church have been in our shoes so yeah just being there